demanding academy. Nestled in the heart of the rolling hills, surrounded by ancient oaks and the whispers of the wind, stood the demanding academy. Renowned for its rigorous academic curriculum and commitment to excellence, the academy was a beacon of intellectual pursuit, drawing students from far and wide who sought to challenge themselves beyond conventional limits. The academy's reputation for demanding standards was built on the legacy of its visionary founder, Professor Eleanor Havisham. A woman of unwavering dedication to the pursuit of knowledge, Professor Havisham believed that true education was born out of resilience and perseverance. With this ethos, the demanding academy had risen to prominence, producing scholars, inventors, and thinkers who left an indelible mark on the world. The campus, an architectural marvel that blended tradition with modernity, echoed with the footsteps of students engaged in a relentless quest for academic excellence. Towering libraries, state-of-the-art laboratories, and classrooms filled with the hum of intellectual discourse defined the landscape of the demanding academy. One student who arrived with dreams as vast as the academy's reputation was Evelyn Harper. A young prodigy with a thirst for knowledge, Evelyn had heard tales of the academy's demanding nature and considered it the perfect crucible for her ambitions. With determination in her heart and books in her arms, she entered the hallowed halls of the demanding academy, ready to embark on a journey that would shape her future. From the outset, Evelyn discovered that the academy lived up to its name. The coursework was challenging, the expectations were high, and the professors were known for their uncompromising standards. However, rather than daunting her, these challenges fueled Evelyn's passion for learning. She embraced the demanding nature of the academy as an opportunity to stretch her intellectual boundaries, to question, and to grow. The professors, though stern and exacting, recognized the potential in students like Evelyn. Professor Havisham herself took an interest in Evelyn's pursuits, guiding her through intricate subjects and encouraging her to explore the uncharted realms of knowledge. Evelyn found herself immersed in a world where every lesson was an adventure, every assignment a puzzle to be solved. As the years passed, Evelyn's reputation as a brilliant mind at the demanding academy spread. She became a symbol of resilience and tenacity, inspiring her peers to push beyond their perceived limits. The academy, in turn, began to evolve. It wasn't just a place of demanding standards, it became a crucible for forging leaders, thinkers, and visionaries who would shape the world with their intellect and ingenuity. Yet, the journey was not without its trials. The pressure to excel, the weight of expectations, and the relentless pursuit of perfection took its toll on some students. It became evident that the demanding nature of the academy, while fostering brilliance, also required a delicate balance to safeguard the well-being of its students. In response, the academy introduced support systems to help students navigate the challenges. Counseling services, mentorship programs, and extracurricular activities aimed at fostering holistic development became integral components of the demanding academy experience. It was a recognition that brilliance flourished not just in the crucible of academic rigor but in the harmonious balance of mind, body, and spirit. As Evelyn approached her graduation day, she reflected on her transformative journey at the Demanding Academy. The challenges, though formidable, had sculpted her into a person of depth and resilience. She had not only mastered the intricacies of her chosen field but had also developed a profound understanding of the importance of balance and well-being. On the day of her graduation, Professor Havisham stood on the podium, addressing the graduating class. She spoke of the Academy's legacy, of the brilliance it had nurtured, and the responsibility that came with intellectual prowess. As Evelyn walked across the stage to receive her diploma, she felt a profound sense of gratitude for the demanding Academy that had shaped her into the person she had become. Years later, as Evelyn ventured into the world as a scholar and a leader, she carried the lessons of the demanding Academy with her. The pursuit of excellence, tempered by compassion and a commitment to holistic growth, became the guiding principles of her endeavors. And so, the demanding academy continued to stand as a bastion of intellectual rigor, but now with an evolved understanding of the delicate balance required to foster brilliance. Its legacy persisted not just in the brilliance of its graduates but in the ethos that brilliance, to truly endure, must be nurtured in the crucible of demanding standards, tempered with empathy, and forged with a commitment to the well-being of those who sought knowledge within its hallowed halls.